Hello everyone, LinuxX2 here, and I'm here to play XCOM and we then. I just got done beating X XCOM 2, but yeah, I felt like I felt like I'd rather be playing in within after I just beat XCOM 2. Because I wanted to play more XCOM, but at the same time, I didn't want to play the same game over again. Just didn't have any XCOM fill, you know? But wait, what's the options on? Alright, normal. Uh, we'll do classic. That's the question here. The normal is very relaxing, the classic is kind of the true XCOM experience. I mean, normal still does have some of that brutality, but not as much. It's good. Just for the video, um... I don't want Iron Man because I'm going to Bronze Man this. Watch that one, and I only have to worry about the middle of this town one. Alright, let's see. Second wave. Is there any of these options I want? Don't want down to roulette. Mm. Save scum. Watch fog. I'm not sure I really want to put any of these on. Yes, I think it's annoying. I think it's annoying to think about the thing, but you're not. But at the same time, that applies both ways. Do I want to... I play aggressively. You know what? Screw it. Good am aiming angles. Is it on? Yeah, it is. Right now, let's start this game. The experimental world for research ball of Lia, I guess. So, John, what do you think this is? Well, I don't think it, it's... I'm not saying it's aliens. But it may be aliens. You're stupid. Well, go, 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 an extraterrestrial incursion. This Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You have been chosen to lead this initiative to oversee our first and last line of defense. Your efforts will have considerable influence on this planet's future. We urge you to keep that in mind as you proceed. Good 
normally I'll keep quiet during cutscenes, but still. I just felt like I had to do it. It's the. It, uh, do one of those alien jokes. Alright, so we can choose our own base. We, North America. All aircraft and These are. Well, by the way, I should explain these. These are the content bonuses in case you don't. In case you're not aware of how this game works, but. When you choose your base, you automatically get the con automatically get the continent bonus, but you can, you can obtain these in a different way. This just makes it easier. Um, let's see. Aircraft. Try to remember these. That's just the easiest continent bonus to get. And I dumped down like in hold in a second. Okay then, sorry about that. I needed to clear some space, so I just deleted a giant MMO. Alright. But this one is kind of useful because you just, just completely do it right off the bat. Mm. Funding, yeah. Thing is. Well, all of the aircraft weapons cost 50% of the to maintain. This is nice for my playstyle, as I like to put satellites everywhere. And once you put satellites down, it's kind of hard to protect them without, without uh, aircraft. So... We're going... <laughs> so, go! So, let's do this. I was trying to think of a joke, but I could not. Get ready to deploy. Our AO is within the continental United States. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Alright, this is in San Francisco. Um, so I assume these aliens are a bunch of gays, or they, they just hate gays and that's why they're invading there. Right somewhere. Now, this is central. You are free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take any chances. Uh, the camera just feels so slow uh, because I'm on a smaller resolution, so that way I could record at the proper resolution. Anyway, as I was saying, why couldn't they invade somewhere less important, like say Detroit? Alright, this. Even though this is not XCOM 2, I still play with a bunch of dashes. That's what we're looking for. And I just detected, uh, I think it was five. Yeah, five sexualists. No, six! Oh, crap. <laughs> and I picked classic, that's right. <laughs> That's what I do if I was playing normal. Oh, derp. Okay, they are going to get the first shot, so who cares now at this point. Just put everyone behind full cover. So they don't die. Stepping off. Okay, put you there. Oh, let's please don't have, please don't have, please don't. Oh, this is okay. Focus fire on the one that is buffing. Got it. Got a lot of heat on me. I think this blue is covered. Damn, that was close. Oh yeah, he's out of cover now. Whoa. 
Holy crap, he's dodging like crazy! Oh wow, that that could have been ended so much worse. Yeah, you're out of cover, so you need to get you some better cover now. Oh, you're completely exposed. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be awesome. Cause if you don't, for those of you who don't know, kill the one that's buffing, and the other one gets some feedback that'll kill him. <laughs> All right, let's uh, put you in a bit more of a aggressive position. Can you just toss a grenade up there if we can. Ugh, we can't do it. We're at sh shot chances. 62. 65, and I'm getting low frame rate. Sorry, guys. I think we're running out of room here again. Uh, yeah, let's take the shot. Let's just try a grenade here. Let's get both of them, even though it's going to damage even more. Are there a lot of fragments? Explosives. That means you destroy their uh, their weapons. See, only one of those popped up, meaning that it was only this guy. But at least that person had a promotion. So yeah. Uh, sadly, none of these guys have got a run gun. We have some chance to hit that one. Sure, why not? <sighs> Rookie suck. Damn it! Missed the target. I'm not sure if you got LOS on anybody there, so. On my way. Oh wait, you did. They have two shots. 74 and 25. Let's go for 74. And you only do two damage. Figures. <sighs> He's buffing. And they're flanked, so. Oh, we are lost. We lost one. Oh, and panicking. Oh, crap. Panicking means that they. They do a random action. Get the cover on fire exit. Oh, the meld is almost not recoverable. Oh, I hope I already killed him by now. Ugh. This is XCOM for you. But it gets worse. Even though you think, what do you, what's the thing, you can't get any worse? It gets worse. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm going to fire another grenade. Okay, why are you lowering the frame? And those weren't the last of the second, so there's one right here. And we lost that milk cancer, like it said. Uh, let me check my space. I got plenty of space. What the heck is going on with that? Okay, these guys are no longer panicking. You got a promotion. I think you earned one, and you have not, I think. I think he got line sight from there. What's with this? This? Why? Why, Fraps? This is Fraps' fault. I know it's Fraps' fault. It's not my computer or anything. Hold on. I'm just not sure what's going on. I th think it's just processing or something. So let me wait up. 
Did that show it just only grazed him a bit, so it's moving. Mm, like Heading it. to that location. I'm gonna use a pistol because no it's just it doesn't cost me ammo. And I think you'll sit up. Moving. And reach. And here comes the reaction shot. Nothing. Adjusting aim. Open okay, while my uninstall is done, so I should have more room in case room is actually the problem. There's the other melt caster. Alright, Gung Ho. Let's do this. Point blank shot. Good kill. Bye bye. Good work out there, Strike One. If I may, Commander, the labs are on high alert. Teams are standing by for your orders. We can begin researching the newly recovered artifacts immediately. Pretty good run. Commander to the research labs. Commander I'm not forget this. Is, I'm only really playing classic. Oh, I don't know. Welcome to XCOM HQ, Commander. I'm Central Officer Bradford. My role in this project is twofold: providing tactical support for our field operations and keeping you briefed on the current situation. My efforts should allow you to focus on the bigger issues at hand. Speaking of which, we have a soldier waiting for a promotion in the barracks. I'll let you get to it. Alright. Alright, so we're now at our underground base. So, we lost one guy. <laughs> We've got two promotions. Oh, that. Support. And a grenade. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. I mean, playing too much, uh, so I'm too he heavy. The recovered artifacts are being unloaded, and the research team is waiting your orders. We'll get started as soon as you give the order, Commander. Alright, sweet. Commander, you can now honor our soldiers by awarding them medals for accomplishments you deem appropriate. You can view and award medals in the barracks. Alright, the Defender Medal. Alright, well first we assign the power. To the research labs. Commander to the research labs. That will become actually I think that'll be more useful because when you're at a once are high rank, panic is not really gonna be a problem. So we need the metal as let's what shall we name this? Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. I was gonna just cut it and then cut to uh, like a to funny the name. Labs. Commander to but the research labs. yeah, I could not come up with anything funny or anything. I decided to just wait for something. So we won't have it just means defenders mail. Oh, award it. Yeah, I'll keep it for now. If you want to save that for someone who sticks it out. Ooh, Scarlet. The Scott. The Scotsman. Hmm. I normally only name people unless they are sergeant above. Just looking at people. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. You know, I think I'll name people right away, so that way it's. I can get more attached to them, so that way when they die horribly, I cry. Alright, so... Time to cut. Alright, we got our... I've just made them all, and I will show you them when we first deploy.
Oh, I forgot one of them is wounded, so I guess I'll have to create a new another one, but other than that, I guess I'll uh, create a new one when I decide, or just, just make it a red shirt. Ah, Commander. I was wondering when you'd be stopping by. Welcome to engineering. Anything they can dream up in the research labs, we can build it here. Speaking of which, Dr. Valen has just sent us some new schematics. With your approval, we will begin fabrication. Uh, uh, stupid freaking family? Alright, well... Commander to the research labs. We Commander might as well buy a med kit. We don't have any reason not to. Cement work. And, uh, gets doing this thing again. I think I just need to stop recording and start again. Alright, let's now go to research. Hello, Commander. My name is Dr. Farlan. I oversee the research labs. This is where all of XCOM's research and development takes place. We have already begun analyzing the artifacts recovered from our first encounter with the aliens. Based on our preliminary findings, we believe we can use them to develop some new equipment for our soldiers. With your approval, we will begin research immediately. German accents are so sexy. Alright, let's research. Commander to mission no. control. Commander to mission That's control. I agree. That does good. seem to be the most pressing of our current research options. We'll begin immediately. I will notify you when a complete report is available. Now the mission control. Okay, we can start scanning, although I feel like this is a good place to stop the episode. Next time we'll, we'll be scanning for activity, and this is just basically past the time until the next thing happens. So, anyway, talk to you later. Take care.